AJ and Enrique Melendez have been married since 2014 and just moved into their first home where they hope to raise a family, but the adoption process may be getting harder. Last month, Florida passed a bill that will give permission to private adoption agencies to turn down gay couples if it's against their moral values. Three other states are proposing the same. We want the same fundamental rights and uh, you know abilities that everybody else has in raising a family. Is it right to allow private adoption agencies to refuse gay couples if it's a part of their religious belief? You want both a boy and a girl uh, to, as a child to receive the expression of love, the expression of masculine and feminine together so they might have both experiences in their life. You know, we don't have, you know, this like nuclear family anymore. The American dream of what family life was like ended a long time ago. Um, there's so many waiting children out there that are getting adopted to families who don't really care. They're just in it for money or stuff like that. I believe that everybody should have a chance to, to start a family um, and really have a kid to be able to nourish and bring up and teach them new things. Ch children who have been orphaned are in a very uh, delicate situation and obviously we need to do all that we can in order to provide for all their needs, uh, their human needs, their spiritual needs, their intellectual educational needs. But um, we also have to make sure that wherever they go, they're in the best situation. According to AdoptUSKids.org, as of March 2010, there are almost 8,000 children in placement in New Jersey. But why are so many children still without a home? A lot of them feel, I want to say scared, um, that gay couples are not good enough parents because they're stuck in their ways about um, families having to be a man and a woman. Um, and they don't feel that, they, that two men or two women can bring up a family correctly. I think it's really difficult, but I, I hope that as more and more families come out about their need and the want to adopt children, that we'll have more same gender loving couples. We're just excited to start this new venture and looking forward to getting the house ready and together and hopefully proceed with going forward and adopting a, a wonderful child into our lives. In South Bound Brook, I'm Sandy Ibrahim.